Welcome back Freedivers, today we are back with a new video and we're gonna talk about how to correctly propel yourself with a monofin in the most efficient way as possible. We're going to learn this into the ocean instead of in the pool because moving vertically instead of horizontally like we usually do in a pool is much easier and it allows us to be more free underwater. Stay tuned. Welcome back freedivers. As you can see in the video, I'm actually coming back up from a deep dive with the monofin and I am very fast, very hydrodynamic with my monofin. Monofin is the best tool to move fast underwater, wasting as less oxygen as possible. So, rule number one, when using a monofin, be sure you're just moving your monofin, moving only your central part of the body, your hips and your central part of the body only. So you just need to push your monofin just by moving up and down your ribs and your central part of the body only. The legs shouldn't move, they need to stay stopped. You shouldn't bend your legs, you shouldn't bend your knees. Legs and knees need to be stopped and stable. Only the hips and the central part of the body need to be moved. So you only can push your monofin through water just by moving your hips, just with the movement of your central part of the body. That's absolutely key. Rule number two, we talk about arms. Arms need to be stretched and straight upon your head so that you can be faster and more hydrodynamic underwater. Never bend your arms upon your head because otherwise you will be slower, less hydrodynamic and you will take much more effort because actually bending your arms upon your head will actually block you and stop you, making you slower, making you wasting more oxygen. So make sure you're actually stretching your arms upon your head. And that's key, to be faster underwater. Rule number three, if you are an hands-free equalizer, it's better because you just don't need to keep on frenzling placing your arms and your hand on your nose every time while going up and down with the monofin, especially while descending. That's a problem we have while descending, so that's actually uncomfortable. For today, that was everything and I hope you actually enjoyed the video.